Hey there, today I'm sharing these cute little planters and a tutorial about how to make them using epoxy resin and some little geometric silicone molds. So the first thing I did was to mix my resin and I used a two-part epoxy resin which just comes in two different jars and you pour equal amounts into one cup and mix it together to form what you'll make your planter out of. And then I added some black alcohol ink and a variety of these really beautiful shimmery dye powders that are specifically designed for resin and soap making and candle making and whatnot um, to get this beautiful kind of blackish, grayish, silverish, bluish color. When you pour the mixture into the molds, you'll see in this close-up shot that as it settles, it will move to the center. And this is a sped up version of the video. It doesn't, it usually takes a lot longer than this. Um, and it starts to form all of these little bubbles. It's very common when working with resin. So to pop these bubbles, you can do a couple different things. But what I'm using for my tutorial today is a Wagner Inferno 500 heat gun, which is pictured here. And this is a heat gun with an LED screen and it has different fan settings and heat settings that you can use for different projects. So you can see here, the heat gun just blows all of the bubbles right out. And it also has um, the added bonus of mixing the colors together a little bit more and just kind of making it look like a more finished product. And here you can see another close-up of the bubbles forming and then grabbing the heat gun and mixing up this top layer and popping all of these tiny little bubbles and large bubbles that are rising to the surface um, as the air tries to escape the resin in the silicone mold. After the resin has completely cured, it's really easy to pop these guys right out of the mold and then you can do whatever you want with them. You can put little cuttings in them, little propagated pieces or something like an air plant. They're the perfect size for that.